thought you couldn't do it cause you washed up Ain't like them bad girls said you should get your sauce up But I got this plan and you might not understand I'ma go hard as I can and I'm gonna be the boss Right before we get started you guys, go ahead and hit that red subscribe button If you have not subscribed already And once you hit that red button, don't forget to turn on the notification bell That's how you will see all my latest videos and keep up with the latest and what's going on with this channel and also you guys go ahead and give me a big thumbs up if you do not mind and here we go on to the video okay guys this time when i got clothes from lovely wholesale i made sure to get more than two pieces because i wanted to give you guys an honest review on what i bought and i went to buy more than two pieces and more than spandex so I chose some of their other clothing and if you're wondering why I'm holding this on my shoulders like this, it's the jacket that goes with a sweatsuit that I bought from Lovely Hotel. So just holding on here because I'm about to show it to you guys. But before I get into that, I just want to get into all the small little details about Lovely Hotel. Um, about how much the shipping was and um, how long it took for shipping. Shipping is very expensive. Um, I think my total price for shipping was like $22, which is extremely high. For me, it is extremely high. It's not um, expedient uh, shipping. So, so, you guys want to be leery of that when you're ordering from them. And also, it took about three weeks to get the clothes back, maybe three and a half weeks. Um, but it takes a long time. So, if you want something to wear on the weekend, order it at least four weeks prior to the weekend that you're going out. Just keep in mind, shipping does take a while. Um, and for all the clothes that I ordered, I ordered everything in a small. Uh, so you can see how it would fit like if you were small. Um, I'm actually 5'3 and I'm about 115 pounds. So it gives you an idea of how it might fit you. And keep in mind that everybody's body shape is different. So it gives you like a roundabout figure. Okay, so with that being said, you guys, I don't want to prolong it anymore. My first outfit will be sweatsuit. And I, I chose this one first because I decided to wear it on this video. Um, here's the jacket. This jacket is an over the head jacket. Um, it has a zipper in the front right here, which zips about right here. Um, it has a zipper pocket in the front and you can keep something in it. And it also has a drawstring for the bottom of the jacket. And just about the quality of this jacket, it is the thinnest material that you can get. It's almost like a parachute. Um, I don't know if you guys play the parachute thing um, in elementary school. I know I did, and yeah, I'm kind of telling my age, but whatever. Um, also, like I said, it's cheaply made. I thought the sweatsuit was very cute. It is cute, but it's cheaply made. There's a hole there where they didn't. Um, attach the zipper properly. I don't know if you guys can see it, but it's a hole like right there. It's not like a literal hole inside the fabric, but it's just that where they put the zipper, they didn't fit in well. And here are the pants to the sweatsuit. These pants do run big, um, but if you're going for that 90s kind of vibe, it's, I think it's okay to have them a little on the larger side. Um, they are just regular jog joggers. And also, they have no pockets whatsoever. Um, so if you're looking for something with pockets, these are not it. And also the jacket, I mentioned before that there's a zipper pocket in the front, but it's just an illusion. There's no pocket here. Um, and so you guys will see how this entire sweatsuit looks on, and here it is. Okay, you guys, and the next piece is this mustard colored dress. Um, it goes off the shoulder on one side, but it has like mid to quarter length sleeves. Um, it's supposed to be kind of fitted, but it was on the website. It looks like something that you could be able to wear to church or, you know, if you had like a 
I guess a graduation or some kind of semi-formal place to go, you would be able to wear this. Um, but I must say, it was also a cheaply made item. It's kind of fitted in, in the way it's like, but then it's not. All I can say is you guys, take a look at it. Okay, the next outfit is a two-piece. And you guys, I'm noticing that I bought everything in like these earthy colors or a pinkish color. So, I don't know. This is my go-to colors. I think I look better in those colors. And also, it is fall. So, okay, this is a two-piece. It's like a crop top shirt. Um, the, orange, the sleeves are kind of big. They come out big, but... Um, yeah, just a crop top, nothing special about it. And here are the pants. And they were supposed to have some kind of like this little detail right here. It's supposed to be like a little wave line. But like I said, I'll insert pictures. And you guys can see how it's supposed to look. But these pants are very big. So if you are a size small, I would advise you to get an extra small. because And if you are short, they are extra long. And also these pants are a size small. The whole outfit is a size small. Um, the fabric is like this thin stretchy material. Would fit tight if it fit, um, depending on, I guess the size that you get or whatever. But you guys can see right here, me versus the lovely hotel picture or model. And tell me what you guys think. Guys, the next piece that I bought was a um, fuzzy jacket, which I am going to insert pictures um, somewhere around here and show you guys how it looks on their website versus what it looks like in person and on me. Um, you guys know like the fuzzy jacket that this in now, this is what it's supposed to be. Uh, just a jacket with no buttons, no zipper, no anything. Um, and it is a small. Oh, sorry. I didn't buy everything in the small, you guys. I bought this one in a medium. Hmm. Okay. And as you can see, it's very flimsy. This one is very cheaply made, but I mean, that's what you kind of expect for the price that you pay. Um, with loads of wholesale, so it's not a big shocker for me. Um, the way the clothes came back. But I have to say, this one right here, it is not like it was on the website. It's more flimsy and more cheaply made. And also, it doesn't have like a form to it, if you understand what I'm saying. If you don't, you guys just watch and maybe you can get what I'm saying right here. Okay, the next outfit and the last outfit is a three-piece set. It came with a, a cropped t-shirt and it's like this burnt orange fall color. It has like little specks of brown in it. I thought the color was really pretty. And it came with pants, uh, the pants are wide all the way down and they were supposed to be a little fitted at the top and they are also high waist pants and I also got this in a size small. Um, 
This material is very, 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 very thin. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's pretty thin. And this also, it had like a funny smell to it. Um, it had a funny smell to it, but you guys, when you get the clothes, I advise you to wash them before you wear them anyway. But knowing that they are a lower quality of clothes, I advise you also not to dry them. Um, it came with this long cardigan like uh, cardigan, I guess. Yeah. But as you can see, it, can, it is very thin. I don't know if you guys can see through that, but it's thin. And it is um, long sleeves or four sleeves. I can't remember when I tried it on. You guys will see when I show you. You will see me versus the lovely wholesale model. Also, and I don't know if I said it or not, but this is in a size small. So, without further ado, here it goes. Okay, you guys, this is it for the second Lovely Wholesale try on haul. I hope you guys got more information about um, what kind of products they sell and how the pricing and the shipping is. Um, if I left anything out, please feel free to leave me a comment and let me know what you guys want to know about the website or what do you want to know about any of these clothes that I purchased. Or anything you want to know, anything that I might have left out, I'll be happy to let you guys know in the comment section below. And also, thanks you guys for joining me again, and I appreciate your support. And also, don't forget to share this video because sharing is caring. And thanks you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the next video.